Since you were born, it's a piece that's made through images that I've set my laptop up to collect passively all the images that come through my browser. And so this is a, an installation that's made from all these images that I've seen, every single image that I've seen on the internet from the moment my daughter Aya was born until the space filled up. So it ended up being just over six months worth of browsing data. I mean, I see Since You Were Born as a, as a portraiture piece, but it's, it's me, it's my data, so on the one hand it's meant to be about me, but I'm, I'm actually more interested in it being sort of a snapshot of the internet at a given time. It's maybe more a portrait of the internet in a given moment of time than it is necessarily about me, and that's, that's one thing that I hope is part of the viewing experience for people, that it's less about digging through these images and see what naughty things I've been doing on the internet, and more about being confronted with kind of the weight of all these images that are coming through. What's happening on the wall here is actually a small portrait. I mean, the portrait that these companies like Google and Facebook have on us, what you see here is just a minor fraction of this larger portrait that exists for all of us that we just don't get to actually see as much. The way that it's constructed is, I basically have a script on my laptop that runs every two weeks, and it's just archiving these cache directories. As you're, as you're surfing the internet and JPEGs are showing up in the browser, they're being stored locally in a directory that's being overwritten. The script runs every once in a while, and it turns those into the zip folder. So I have a, a, an archive of zip folders that are dated with my browsing activity. So that's the first step. And then the next step is to stitch them together. I'm using, I'm using a really specific piece of software that doesn't have a huge use case scenario. It's called Texture Packer. It's a piece of software mostly for web designers or game designers, and it's meant to make really small, compact, very efficient images. With that software, I'm basically dumping just thousands and thousands of images at it. The work is also meant to be questioning about how true or false is this as a portrait. Like, are we the sum of our browsing data, which of course I don't think we are. And so there's, there's moments when the piece I feel like is really poor representation of sort of who I am as a person or who I am as an internet user or what the internet is. Um, but that's meant to be part of it too. It's like, are these, are these portraits that c companies like Google and Facebook have of us, are those accurate representations of who we are?